We have three different ice cream beauty bags to get through today. I have no idea when they're from. I just know they're not from this month. We're gonna go ahead and do the skinny one first. Based on the card, this is from June. The first thing that I'm pulling out is by Gerard Cosmetics. I don't particularly like their products. Everything that I've gotten from Gerard Cosmetics just, just does not hit. That lippy that I got in an Ipsy mystery bag was so gross and old and just ugly, okay? It was just ugly. But hopefully this one will be a good a good shade. This is the Color Your Smile Lip Gloss. And this is what the box is looking like. Ooh, okay, this is actually a really pretty color. This is what it looks like. Is this supposed to be like a mirror? Ooh, okay, I think that is so cool. On the back of this lippy, there's a little mirror right there. Now, I'm not sure why we would get a color like this in like June, which is the middle of summer. This is perfect for winter, okay? This is a winter lippy, fall maybe, but definitely winter. And that is absolutely stunning. Maybe Gerard Cosmetics is making a comeback, okay? We'll see, we'll see. We'll try it on the lips and see how it feels. But as far as that color goes, that is gorgeous. Next is a matte eyeshadow, and this is from the brand Crown. And this is what it looks like. I don't particularly like single eyeshadows. I prefer a palette, okay? I don't wanna be reaching for a single eyeshadow ever. This is what it looks like. Let's see. Oh my God, it fell out of the thing. Yeah. Bruh, it like literally fell out. <laughs> I don't know what kind of packaging this is supposed to be, but it's just not good. And the color itself is very like ashy and not opaque. This packaging is trash because it just fell right out. There's no glue, no nothing to kind of hold it down. Let's see if it's destroyed. Okay, I'm gonna see if it's destroyed. And if it is, I'm just gonna toss it. It's not destroyed. Why would you make it so that this could just pop right out so easily? There should at least be like a magnet here so that if you wanted to pull it out, you could. But if you, you know, turn it or think things like that, it's not gonna just fall out. So this is a no for me, dog. It's a no. The color isn't that good. It's not an interesting color. Um, I wouldn't reach for something like this. If it was a beautiful like duochrome or something like that, then yeah, I would reach for it. So <laughs> we have three more and they're not interesting. This is the next one and then we have this. And then we have this one. Now this is pretty. I will open this up and see how it performs. I don't have high hopes, okay? I just don't. Well, let's see. Okay, now that color, beautiful. I would reach for that. I will put these in the giveaway and hopefully somebody else will get some use out of it and will enjoy it, because I know I won't. So far, just not that impressed. I really like that lip gloss, but then the little loose shadows are just not the best. And the last thing is from ZC and it's so cute. It's so cute, look at that cute little kitty cat. I don't like cats, but they're cute. Okay, they're very cute. I would never want one, but they're cute to look at. <laughs> okay, very cute to look at. I love the way this feels. Like the packaging just feels so nice. Ooh, this is cute. Okay, this is so cute. Look at that. I love the packaging for ZC products. They're usually really, really nice. And it comes with a mirror. Okay, it comes with a mirror. And these are your shadows. But I'm very curious as to what this one looks like. Here are the colors. Um, that one I was very excited about barely shows up. So I guess that's more of like a topper. This one's very ashy, so I probably will not be using this. These other two, very pretty, very opaque. They show up beautifully. These two, mm, maybe not so much. I mean, I might use that as like an inner corner. Let's go through the prices for this tipsy, that's cute, tipsy kitty eyeshadow quad. This is gonna run you $20. The Crown Pro eyeshadow singles are $12. Now, I wonder if that's $12 each or $12 for all of them. If it's $12 each, I'm gonna need you to figure out your packaging. So the price ain't ma making sense with the packaging. The packaging needs work. And then the Gerard Cosmetics Color Your Smile Gloss is $24, which again, very pricey, but at least the packaging is on point, okay? It looks like it's worth $20. Not my favorites. <laughs> so we're not quite starting off with the bang, unfortunately. 
This one is from May. It has the beautiful Mother's Day flowers on there. The first thing that I'm pulling out is Time Bomb Face Primer by The Balm. Okay, that's what it is. And this is what it looks like. Ooh, okay, very interesting. This is what the packaging is looking like. I already have so many primers, okay? I am swimming in primers I don't need anymore. So I'm not gonna do any like little swatches or anything like that. So I'm gonna put this in the giveaway for somebody else to try and hopefully love. The Balm is a good brand. I've tried other things from them. All right, the next thing is another product by Gerard Cosmetics. Hopefully it's good like the last one. And this is the Light em Up Lip Gloss. Oh, so they were just popping Gerard lip glosses in all these bags. Let's see, hopefully this one's cute. Is this the same color? Okay, no, they're different. They're different, but I don't understand why this is coming in May, where it's like springtime. You're supposed to be giving like bright, colorful pastel, those type of colors. Here we are with this very deep color. Hold up, this thing lights up. That's interesting. That is very interesting technology. When you open it up, it like literally lights up. <laughs> That is very interesting and that is a beautiful color. Let's see. So it's just another another purple. It's not the same though. At least I don't think. This one says James. This one says seduction. So they're different colors, but very similar. And very much so December, <laughs> November, fall. Okay, it is winter and fall colors, but we got this in the spring. I ain't mad at it. I just think this is so cool. I'm not gonna put the color on, but I just wanna see. <laughs> <laughs> that is very interesting. I like that, that's innovative. Okay, that's very innovative and it has the mirror on the back as well. Okay, Charger Rogers, okay, Gerard Cosmetics. Maybe I judged you too soon, okay? Maybe it was Ipsy's fault. They just reached back and grabbed some old ass inventory and made you look bad. This is really nice and so is the other gloss. The next thing is an eyeshadow palette. And this is by Illuminati Cosmetics. Now I've tried, I think I've tried a lip gloss and a mascara from them and I liked it. So hopefully I like this as well. And this is what it looks like. Ooh, these colors are pretty. These colors are actually very, very beautiful. I feel like that purple that I got last time is already in this palette. Let's try a few of these shadows out. I'm not gonna do the whole thing. Let me just see which ones are, are speaking to me, which ones I think are gonna be ashy and go from there. All right, so here are a few of the swatches of, I'm not gonna lie, not my favorite. They're not showing up that good on my skin. The black is slightly better than that other one we just opened. I'd have to see how they perform on the face. Well, not the face, the eyes. Uh, from this, not, not too impressed. Maybe their eyeshadows aren't popping like the rest of their lineup, which would be unfortunate. But we will try her out and see how she performs on the eyes. For the Illuminati Cosmetics Sparkle and Shine palette, you're looking at $22. I have to try it on my face to see if it's worth $22. Right now, I'm a little skeptical. The face primer by The Balm, you looking at $30. Finally, the Gerard Cosmetics Color Your Smile Gloss Again, $24. So far, Gerard Cosmetics is still in the show. Like, what is this? <laughs> now for the final ice cream beauty bag. And this is the biggest one. The first thing that I'm pulling out is by Sugar Drizzle. Is that what it is? Sugar Drizzle? And this is a lip gloss in the color Girly. Okay, very girly. And I love this packaging. The iridescence is so pretty. Okay, this is very girly and it's very Xenon. <gasps> Okay, this is cute. Okay, this is cute. Y'all, look at this. <laughs> it comes with a cute little bear. That is so cute. And it's just like a nice little lip gloss. Let's see, I'm definitely keeping this. I love a good, look, good, cute moment. All right, and it does lay down some pigment. That is nice. And this is what it looks like, very cute. I like this, a little dangly dangly. It's so cute, it's just a little teddy bear. Oh, it's so cute. All right, we starting off good, we starting off good. The next Next thing in here is from ZC and it is a lasting setting spray. I wanna open it to see what the actual spray looks like. I don't know if I will be keeping this. This might be going in a giveaway. So I wanna keep the 
box as intact as I can, but struggling. And this is what the setting spray is looking like. Very sleek. This will be going into a giveaway for one of my luckily, luckily, one of my lucky viewers to try out, okay? And y'all can let us know if it made your makeup last. And this is from Charmacy, which I actually really like Charmacy. They've given us a couple different things. They had a really nice duo eyeliner, which beautiful, absolutely stunning. And then they had like some duo chrome products, gorgeous. So I am very excited. That looks so luxe. I love that. Let's see. Ooh, Charmacy. Come on, girl. This is so cute. I love this little packaging for it. It has like this nice, nice sleeve that your palette comes in. That is nice. Y'all need to give uh, the crown some some pointers, okay? They need some pointers on packaging because this ain't it, this is it, <laughs> okay? This is it. And this is what it looks like on the outside. Ooh, okay, pretty, very pretty. These are the shadows we're working with. It comes with a mirror, very gorgeous. I am very excited to, I keep saying very. I'm excited to play with these colors. I did not go into all the colors, but I did get a few. And these first two really didn't show up that well. They might be toppers, okay? They might be toppers, but these three, gorgeous, very opaque. I'm excited about this. It's like a green, like a dark mossy green with like sparkles in it. And those colors make my eyes pop, okay? Your girl got hazel eyes. So I eat with shadows like this. This might be my favorite bag, okay? It might be my favorite bag because I actually like pretty much everything that I got in here, except for like the settings where I wouldn't know. I mean, the packaging is nice. And ZC is usually pretty good. Now the Charmacy Global 12 color palette is $27. For this pack, I would pay $27, okay? I would pay all 27 of them dollars for this product because it's just, it's so beautiful and the colors seem like they're gonna work very, very well. For the ZC Cosmetics Setting Spray, you looking at $29. Ooh, that's pricey. Very, very pricey. And finally, for this Sugar Drizzle Cosmetics Liquid Lip Gloss, you're looking at $8. And that was three months worth of ice cream beauty bags. Gerard Cosmetics made a comeback. Okay, I was expecting those lip glosses to be trash. I just was. That was everything in my ice cream beauty bag haul. And I'm content. I'm content. I don't have anything else to say. I'm just dragging it at this point. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fey Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Deuces.